Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the White Oak, Pennsylvanian toy collector, and it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And today we'll be reviewing a Transformer this week because it's Transformers week. And this is no ordinary Transformer. It's from Transformers Generation 1 from the 80s. And it's Mixmaster. I can't help but do the theme song. The Transformers, more than meets the eye. Autobots wage their battle to destroy the evil forces of the Decepticons. The Transformers, robots in disguise. Autobots wage their battle to destroy the evil forces of the Decepticons. But yeah, we are looking at the G1 Mixmaster. And he is a little cement trunk with a cement drum that moves. Why not? He rolls very well. For a construction vehicle of this size. I don't have his proper guns. So that's why you're seeing this weird gun on him. Why not? No, I say why not. But now for comparison. Here is G1 Mixmaster next to Leader Scrapper. Well, he is missing one piece. But I don't really care. Unless I actually find one complete, but yeah, this one is more complete than that one, except for the bit that goes into here. But now we're going to transform Generation 1 Mixmaster, which is very simple. Pull this up. Flip this around. Connect it in like that to form his legs. Pull out his arms. A little bit stubborn today. With your arm today, huh, Mixmaster? And there we got Mixmaster in his robot mode. It doesn't have any articulation. This is a simple Transformers Generation 1 Mixmaster. And we can give him this gun. So he can have a gun. He can go pew pew, bang bang. Why not? And he is pretty cool looking. He's not very tall looking. But now we're going to do a comparison next to Scrapper. The leader of the Constructicons. Why not? But here we got Scrapper and Mixmaster. And they look good together, if I do say so myself. I still have about three more to find of these. I found, when I went to Steel City Con, I found Long Haul and Mixmaster. So I still need Hook, Scavenger, and Bone Crusher to form a G1 Devastator. So this set is nearly complete. But yeah, articulation, not much. You can get some movement out of the arms right there. But now we're going to show off the gimmick they have in combined mode. So we're going to transform them back into their vehicle modes. Just back like so. Rotate that up if I can get it to work. And there we got leg mode for Devastator. We're going to do that with Scrapper. I'll show you what leg modes look like with these figures. And there we got the legs of the mighty Devastator. Why not? There I say why not. And now we're going to put him back in his robot mode. Very simple. Very easy. Put him back. Got to be careful with these because these are really tight joints and they're easily broken. But now we're going to give a bio on Mixmaster himself. Mixmaster was one of the original Generation 1 Constructicons. And yeah, he mixed chemicals and acids, and that's his bio for sure. Plus he formed the Leg of Devastator, which was what he did. 
and I'm so glad to have nearly a complete set here on my channel to review. Am I going to pick up the rest of these guys? Yes, if I can find the last bit of the Devastator Constructicons, we are definitely going to own the complete set of Generation 1 Devastator and then buy the combined mode bits and make this a complete Decepticon combiner. And I love me some Decepticon combiners. And I highly recommend these guys if you want to review something simple for Transformers Week, if anyone else does a Transformers Week on YouTube. They're highly recommended, and they're from the 80s. So they're very simple. If you get your hands on these 80s toys, they rock. And this is Eddie Hill. Moving on and rock on and rock out. YouTube land.